Well, hello and welcome to Vlogmas Day 8. Oh dear, today is... Do you know what? I don't know. I think it's Thursday. <laughs> that says something, don't I? I don't even know what day it is. Oh well, I'm a bit like Karen. <laughs> Hi Karen from Stitches and Jacks. She didn't know what day it was either the other day, did she? <laughs> Oh dear, gosh, it must be catching. <laughs> it's come all the way down south. <laughs> anyway, this is Little Workroom Crafts. So, woke up this morning to our first Jack Frost painting. That's what my nan used to say. Jack Frost come out at night and paint everything white. <laughs> so, it was covered this morning. Cold, but covered. So, we actually treated ourselves today, well, this morning. We put the heating on. <laughs> Only for an hour. <laughs> Because we don't have a thermostat or nothing, we have to do everything, turn them all on by hand, the radiators. So, got out, just got out of a lovely hot bath with a hot. You know, when you get out of a bath and you turn into a massive big, and it is a massive big goose bump. Because <laughs> it ain't as if I'm a small one. Um, you know what I mean? It's uh, <laughs> It hurts when you dry yourself with your towel. <laughs> oh, but no, we sport ourselves this morning. So I've done my hair, made myself feel a bit better and I've uh, got my Santa earrings in. I'm all Santaed out, look, t-shirt, maybe even got me, there you go, me bottoms on. <laughs> oh dear, I don't even know what time it is, let alone what day it is. So yes, nearly, nearly caught up with my um, wrap. I'm so excited. Last night, oh my gosh, I was tearing away on it, absolutely tearing away and then um it's weird, I know I've said this before, you know, sometimes you can get a skein and it can just cake up absolutely perfect. Another time, it's a nightmare. I don't know what it is. I mean, we must do something this end. We must do. Anyway, <laughs> so um, I was heading on to number, what were we on eight? So I was doing number, I was up ready to put number six on and I was caking up and it got in a right mess. Hour and a half later, I had two little balls of wool because I did have to split it in the end. <sighs> So, but it's looking amazing. Um, so, I've already started putting that in. Well, I started putting it in last night and I've done some more this morning. So, I'm going to go downstairs and do some more while Glenn is doing the dinner. And uh, then I am, uh, then I've got, got to do is put in number seven. Then when I open up number eight, so I should get up to date today, then I can do his nights. So, at least then I feel as if I'm doing some of that because I ain't long now before Christmas. <laughs> So, uh, yeah, oh dear me, but what a morning, little Elmy's been his normal self, he's had his, his playtime with his pom-pom, actually his pom-pom's on the floor, so he must be downstairs with Dad. <laughs> I just make, it's most funny, you make uh, you make the bed and then you've got his section where he's got his crochet blanket that Emma brought uh, made him, and then he's got his uh, habitation throw, this is probably the devil, which he has over him, this is at night time, and he likes tucking under that. <laughs> dear me. Right then, I am going to go downstairs and have a nice cup of tea. Turn the eating off. <laughs> so I'm taking downstairs. And at the end of the stairs this year, I've popped my Santa cross stitch. This is a, oh, it's the popular ones that come out every year. Oh, I knew I'd do this to myself. Oh, I can't even think. My head's gone blank. Oh, well, I'll put it on the screen if I can find it anyway. But I love that. And then on the door there, which I haven't shown yet, this actually was it's years old. And I'm sure it was out of one of the King Cole Christmas books. I think it might have been the first one. And all these are pockets. And it actually is an advent calendar. And the whole thing is crocheted. And I have just put a bit of felt on the back to stable it a bit. <laughs> but yeah, it was so much fun to make. So it's years ago I made it. And I know I added, I think I added this fluffy bit at the bottom. I crocheted that in and I added this. This is just a um, brass ring and I crocheted around it and put some beads. And then I think, oh yeah, you look, I put some beads. But yeah, so that's my crochet epic. Right then, I'm back. 
Glenn's gone off to work. Always leaves me the washing up. <laughs> we don't have a dishwasher. I've never had a dishwasher, so it ain't as if I've missed anything, bits, <laughs> do I? But there we go. The time is quarter past one. Actually, he's left early than normal. I haven't noticed that. I wonder where he's off to. Anyway, <laughs> so I'm going to be doing the washing up. So I am going to carry on with the dishes and tidy up. And then we'll go into the other room and do the cake up after I've done the um, advent. So we'll see if we have Elmo's help this afternoon. <laughs> so I'll see you in a bit. Right then, dishes are done. <laughs> I've got my advents. I've got number seven here ready because I'm going to um, cake up in a moment. I'm just going to explain. That's better. <laughs> I'm just going to explain what has happened to the tea advent. Well, as you know, I love my herbal teas and I was very, very grateful when Teresa gave me um, the Bird and Blend advent. And um, <laughs> last year when I had a couple of advents they had tea bags in them and um, so what I did is I shared I had one and I shared the other one with my brother because my brother loves herbal tea and he never has an advent <sighs> so um but this year obviously I had the one uh, the one tea advent and <laughs> Um, and I thought to myself, oh, you know, I've got all this beautiful yarn and I've got Teresa's lovely box and I've got some lovely, lovely advents and I just felt greedy. So I said to Glenn yesterday, I said, take this in into Diddy um, and, you know, and then he's got his own tea advent. So <laughs> apparently he was well chuffed with that. So <laughs> I hope you're enjoying them, bruv. <laughs> so I've shared it on <laughs> to my brother, my brother, bless him. Okay then, right, so, as I say, after I've finished this, I'm going to cake up the two skeins and then get them on the, the wrap, but I ain't going to show you the wrap today, and then when I've actually caught up, because I'm going to do that as afternoon, um, I will, because um, in this evening I'm, I'm guaranteed to be knitting away on the socks, I will um, show you the progress of it tomorrow, okay, because then I'm going to be putting... Um, opening up and then putting on and open up and putting on and so on. My plan is, I'm hoping, I'll put in the number 24, finish it off and then I've got to block it and as I say, we don't have the heating on really. <laughs> we might treat ourselves over Christmas. Um, so I'm hoping it will be nice and dry because it is a four ply so it shouldn't take too long with it being blocked out and I'll lay it here next to the radiator um, so it'll be nice and dry for Christmas day because I can't wait to wear it. This is going to be one of those uh, wraps that's just going to be worn and worn and worn. I can see it. I really can. Okay then, right. Enough chat, Davina. Let's get on with the admins. Okay then, first today, I am going to do my lovely friend from Scotland because I have two number eights. So we're going to do this one. As we know, this one is going to be the... Uh, going to be the blanket. Oh my goodness me. What a beautiful colour. Isn't that gorgeous? Wow. And I've got another envelope. Oh, oh, oh they're buttons. I'll undo the oh my gosh, they are beautiful, isn't it? Because Bless her, she's joined them so they don't rattle around, I think. Oh, look at these. Let's undo these so I can show you. Um, oh, we'll have to see what I can make to, and put. <laughs> oh dear, come on, that's it. And uh, to put these on. Oh my word, they are beautiful. Absolutely gorgeous. So look at those. Three buttons. Isn't they beautiful? Oh, put them with the yarn. So number eight from Davina. 
obviously we all know now these are going to be the, the scrappy socks oh my gosh oh my gosh oh that is beautiful oh, i'm going to put them on that on glenn's um socks look at that um can you see it on there oh yeah look at that stitch marker oh my goodness me that is absolutely beautiful i'm going to put that on glenn's socks when i when i do them this evening when i get when i catch up after my wrap and look at that beautiful stellini yarn oh that is gorgeous so there the socks that is so pretty number eight from Judas, Paul and Susan. Oh my gosh. What's in the oh, Twix? <laughs> wow, what a colour. That is actually, oh, that's going to look beautiful. Because I know what's in there. So, yeah, yeah. Look at that. Oh, it's a lot deeper than that. Oh, it's a shame. It's a blue fern yarns. Oh, it's so much deeper. It's nearly there it's like a um oh it's a real deep <laughs> i can't it might show up in the photograph actually because sometimes they do don't they so thank you oh let's put that in there right so let's pop my hand in oh so not the tissue <laughs> put my hand in Oh, oh, right. In the Teresa box. Oh, dear. Oh, my. Oh, I love them. Lint chocolates. So we all know what I'm going to be doing this afternoon. <laughs> Just maybe have a cup of tea. Oh, oh my gosh. I love lint chocolates. Oh, thank you. Okay, so thank you all so so much. Oh, I'm just so I'm really really enjoying this. Okay, then right, so I am gonna quickly have a swig of my cup of tea before it gets too cold. Because that's the problem when it gets colder, isn't it? Your tea gets cold work quicker. <laughs> Oh, so and then I am going to uh, cake up these two yarns and then I will be back tomorrow so this will be the last that you see me at the end here in a moment you're going to see just a little clip of me caking up the yarns and as I say I will be back tomorrow so still chilly though but um must admit though there's um my friend up in Scotland the uh, the, the lady that's um doing that she got on her Instagram page this morning and it was um um she went out i thought what did she say what minus eight or minus five something like that and that was in this morning so we are definitely in, and we're in the minuses here as well it's lovely i love it and because it's beautiful sunshine crisp sunshine and as my nan always used to say my old nan's wise words of the day is a frost kills the bugs kills the germs let's good old frost kill the germs <laughs> anyway i'll leave you with that <laughs> Okay, they're right. So I'll see you tomorrow. <laughs> Happy crafting. Bye.